Hey guys, I'm Crazy Tater, and I'm going to show you how to make a simple water uh, water script that if they reach zero, they die. You're pretty much going to need five scripts, although I'm pretty sure you can make it a lot easier with less scripts, but this is the way I did it. First thing is, here's the script. We're going to make it to where when you use a bottle of water, it gives you water. First thing you want is the if to check if they have the bottle of water. And if they do, you want to also check if they are not full with water. The bar up at the top right corner where it says water, if that's full, you don't want them to be able to just drink indefinitely. And after those are both true, or rather, uh, if they have the bottle, yeah, if they're both true, then it would take the bottle of water, and I set it to 10, so it'll give me 10 water, but you can set it to whatever you want. And this is the opposite. If they're not thirsty, if the bar is completely full, it'll just tell them you're not thirsty, and it won't do anything else. You don't need to worry about a script that checks if they don't have a bottle of water, because we're going to make a script that this will only run if they're swinging a bottle of water, so that pretty much checks it for you. The next script we want is the HUD bar. It's pretty easy. I set this one as pretty wide, deep blue for water. I also have it labeled in with numbers so people can see kind of the percentage. I also put it in the top right corner, but you can pretty much modify this however you want. The next is this, this script. It pretty much makes the water go down over time. So what it does is, right when the script is ran, it gives them minus one water. And then it waits however long you want. I set it to 2,000, se or 2000 milliseconds, so we can see, the, see how far it goes down, instead of having to wait for it normally. You should probably set it somewhere around like every 10 seconds or something. That way the bar is not always empty and they have to keep finding water. Next it'll check if they have zero water, it kills them with negative... 999 damage and then it notifies everybody this person died because they didn't drink and then it waits and it resets their their water level because they respawn I set it as wait 1500 because that's about a, a second and a half and it should line up with when they respawn then it checks if they have 15 water it tells them hey you need a drink soon or you're gonna die you could pretty much keep doing that. Here's another 15, but you could switch it to 30 and say, oh, you're running out of water. Or you could do 75 and say you're pretty full on water. And then you put the end if, because that tells this whole section right up here. It says, hey, we're done with that. And then you wait just a little bit so there's a, it gives a tiny bit of a delay and helps with lag a little bit. And you just loop the whole script over so it starts again. If they don't have 0 and they don't have 15, all it's going to do is run these three lines, but that's not really a script. So it's just going to run this line and this line, and it's going to loop again after this wait is done. And then you need the script to turn it on, which pretty much sets up everything. This section right here checks if they have been in the world before. If they have been in the world, or if they have not been in the world before, it sets it that they have been, and it gives them 50 as a default. And if they have not, then it just does nothing. And then after that, it, uh, it'll end, so then the rest of this can run. This turns on the part that makes the water go down over time. This makes it so uh, when you swing the water bottle, it'll actually give you water. And then this one's just your HUD bar to turn on. And this one is the opposite. This just turns everything off. It turns off the water going down, and it turns off the HUD bar. You don't need to worry about turning the water bottle off, because I don't think there's a script to cancel that. But then if you see my water up at the top corner, if I drink water, it goes up. I haven't run the script yet, but if I turn it on, it's going down over time. And if I adjust my history near to, let's say, 2, it's at 2 and then 1, and then when it reaches 0, I die and respawn. 